So I've been seeing in the comments that y'all been sending uh, to my P.O. Box and yeah, I got a bunch of it. Oh, something fell. But P.O. Box haul, let's go. Thank you for sending. I don't, you don't really have to do this at all, really. But you still send it. I have a package right over here. It's like two packages. So let's go through all this and go through these sexy, beautiful people's letters. What is that, Dre? What is wrong with you? The first one. First one is from Radonna. What's up, Radonna? Look at you got a Batman. Look at it. Look at it. Look at look at it. Look at it. Hope you have an amazing day filled with fun and laughter, just like. You deliver to all your viewers. Oh, I hope I hopefully I do deliver happiness somehow. Um, or you just you're like, yeah, that's Dre. I mean, some people are like that, which I don't mind. Thank you. I hope to be able to get you a gift, but it will be a little bit later. With love, Verdana Jackson. P.S. Sorry for the banana bandana hat. I almost said banana hat. Oh, you sent a bandana hat. Oh, was smushed uh, and too long. No, yo, I wear my bandana. I don't. I don't know when to wear it. To be honest, a bandana hat, because I feel like like someone will call me out if I wore this in school in college. Um, and I don't want to get called out for it. Like, yo, were you repping? Like, I don't rep anything. Thank you, Radonna. This is a very cute uh card. I think it's a birthday card. Yo, I haven't. This this is probably gonna be some birthday cards in here. Oh gosh. Well. Even though it's late, thank you so, so much. Uh, Radonna Jackson, thank you for this awesome Batman card. I really love this. And the bandana hat. I don't know, I think I said that before, but I'll say thank you again. <laughs> well, you got a card in here. Ooh. Oh. Well, damn. Happy late B-Day. Basically, by the way, sorry for the B-Day, late B-Day mail. Oh, there you are. Hi, my name is James, and I'm a big fan of yours. I would like to tell you my story. Whenever I get mad or stressed, I want, I watch your videos. Uh, my favorite video is you when you and Camo were reacting to God Seven is just right. If you're gonna say hello, what? If you're gonna have, am I missing a piece? Only way I'm very happy is that you keep making videos that are awesome. You are so dope and cool. You are awesome. I live in Florida, Miami too. What up, Miami represent? By the way, sorry for my handwriting. Hey, nothing wrong with your handwriting. I could read it, could I? I mean, I did stumble a few times, but that's just me. That's all me. Kids, stay in school. Look what you got me. You got me a miniature donut. Yup. Look at it. Look at it. Look. It's eating it. Is that cannibalism? Thank you for this uh, little miniature uh, plushy <laughs> miniature donut. I don't know. I just had this donut ever since I did uh, the skit uh, Food Bay Bay, uh, the parody of Bay Bay from Big Bang. And if you haven't seen my new parody by Zutter, go check it out. But thank you for this. Uh, this is so cute. And I would never expect someone to send me this. Little cute donut with sprinkles. So cute. This letter is from Sally, and it's a happy birthday letter, so it's a late happy birthday. It's all my fault, though. To the king of K-pop. Who the hell is the king of... Nobody, like, nobody's the king of K-pop, Sally? Sa Sally? Sally? I love your channel, Jerry Kim. Having a stepmother from Taiwan and growing up in the Bay Area has always given me the appreciation for Asian culture, but it wasn't until I had my second daughter that I learned about Korea. Aww. I felt uh, the need to find something other than American TV. I feel you. Uh, to watch around my children because it was too vulgar for them in my opinion. I feel you. So, I mean, I, I do, I'm, I'm, I'm kind of vulgar myself. Be careful with your children showing my videos. I do bleep out some words right now. I'll bleep it out because maybe you're watching with your kids right now. I tried movies and shows from different uh, countries, but they weren't what I was looking for until I found K drama dramas three years ago, uh, starting with Secret Garden, and I've been hooked ever since. See, I'm not into dramas for some reason. I don't know why. Uh, it hasn't until a year ago I found K-pop when I needed something to motivate. Uh, to lose all the baby weight. My husband of seven years and I got go on vacation a lot and I don't have internet and the first thing I do when I get home is check out your awesome channel to see what I missed in the world of K-pop. So, happy birthday Dre and he sent pictures too. Uh, hi Sally. Living that K-pop Korean life, K-drama life. I see you Sally. Thank you for this. Thank you for sharing your life a little bit uh, with me and 
much. Yeah. Thank you, Sally, for this happy birthday. Uh, I'm guessing your your kids actually helped out, maybe, or you just did this all by yourself, but Sally, thank you. And yeah, thank you so much. This letter comes from James, and James, let's see what you got, son. From James to Dre and Camel. How are you gonna say ignore this when I you, you tell me to ignore? What? How am I? You can't say ignore this and then I'm gonna ignore it. I'm James and I'm 11 years old. Oh, hi James. Dear Dre, I hope you read this letter, but anyways, every time I see you in camo, it puts a smile on my face. That just put a smile on my face. I just wanted to see your channel grow and love, and the love for K-pop grow. Uh, by the way, I live in Miami. Oh, Miami represent, is this the same James? What's your favorite K-pop group? Boy, then girl. Um. My favorite K-pop group is definitely Big Bang into anyone. Who's your favorite in Big Bang? How'd you... Like you predicted this. Are you a psychic, James? Uh, my favorite in Big Bang is Taeyang. Uh, are you going to KCON Miami? I think I am. Uh, how old is this? Oh, thanks again for this letter, James. I really do appreciate this. This is awesome. Thank you so much. And thank you for the drawing. This letter is from Lindsay. Lindsay, how are you? Don't know why I'm talking like this. Dear JRE KML, my name is Lindsay Wayne. I live in Winslow, Arizona. I am 16 years old and I'm a junior this year. I love your video so much. You are the first YouTuber I have ever wrote a letter to. Well, I feel honored, Lindsay. It's right here, damn. I first wanted to watch your videos with your reaction to Ailey's You and I, but and from there I kept watching more of your videos. Well, thank you. You are so hilarious, you never disappoint me with your videos, and, and my most favorite video of yours is the most turned KCON LA vlog. Thank you! Some people didn't like that. I feel like they don't get my humor or something. I don't know. I laughed so hard at the bloopers you guys did in the video, but Shane's laugh though. For real. I don't know how to, let me recreate it. <laughs> no, that is not Shane's laugh. It was it? I don't remember. I have to watch it again, actually. Also, I can't forget about Camel. I love her so much. She is beautiful and funny. Girl, she right now she's in Latvia for our friend's wedding, so I'll tell her you said that. Is my hair on point though? I hope I can see you at KCON LA next year and hope and to be able to take a picture with you. P.S. Believe. Be yourself and believe. That's for real. You gotta be yourself and believe. Hopefully you took your own advice that you gave me. Uh, sincerely, Lindsay. Happy face. Thank you, Lindsay. You are so sweet. Thank you for this letter. Really do appreciate it. I just want to hug it because it's so warm and fuzzy. Thank you. I'm going to believe in myself. This has a Dre with a heart on it. And it's from Chris Kayla. Chris Kayla? All right. Oh, this, this, this noise. Oh, oh, what the? Okay. Oh, you gave me some stickers. How do how do started playing in my in my uh, mind when I was like looking at these stickers like na 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 stickers. Dear Dre, belated happy birthday. I hope it was awesome. This is a dope letter. Oh my god, it's like so so neat neat, which is not me. And I'm jelly, like a jelly donut. It's not really a jelly donut, but you get what I'm saying. I hope it was awesome and that this letter finds you well. I have never sent something to a YouTuber before. Wow! Some of these are your first. Some of y'all are just first sending letters. <laughs> <laughs> but I saw in your birthday P.O. Box video that you like receiving letters, so I decided to write you one. Well, thank you. I do like receiving letters. Anything. Um, not anything. Let's take that back. <laughs> Don't send anything. Just send, like, you know letters uh, package. I discovered you a few months back when your reaction to Bang 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 was in the related video section. I clicked on it out of curiosity and ended up really liking your personality. Thank you! I'm glad you like my personality because that's what you're gonna get. I'm not talking to you, um, I'm just talking to everybody else. <laughs> um, from there I continued to watch your videos and now I'm a really big fan. Well, I'm glad. Thank you so much. Uh, a little bit about myself. I first discovered K-pop about seven to eight years ago when I heard G-Dragon's cover of This Love on my friend's MySpace profile. Well, damn, MySpace, though. Researched further and got myself into Big Bang. Yes! Yes! Live your life! I want to thank you for making me laugh and smile plenty of times over with your content. Well, I'm glad I can make you laugh, um, hands down. Uh, 
I hope that you continue to do YouTube for a very long time and that you never lose your love for K-pop. Always remember that you have fans that love you and here's to hoping that I get to meet you someday. Oh, I love Chris Santon. Santonil? Santonil. Santonil? Uh, did I say that right? I don't want to mess up your name, but if I did, I do apologize. Uh, well, you're more like, more than fans. Y'all are friends to me. You're like family almost. Uh, it's like every time I do a video, I feel like I'm sharing this with my friends, so I know that sounds sad. I need to make more friends. <laughs> Listen to K-pop, it feels good. That's dope. Yeah. Thank you, Chris. Thank you so much for this beautiful letter and for the stickers. Oh my god, thank you so much. Mm. Stickers, though. <laughs> okay, this is from Lanessa or Vanessa? I think it's Lanessa from North Las Vegas, Nevada. Ooh, I was just recently in Las Vegas, though. Really though, look look at this. Happy birthday. Look at this. Hello Cool J, why are you in my DMs? To a, a take charge kind of guy. This is a random ass hilarious card of what? Happy birthday. These are some happy birthday things that I haven't checked out. I'm so sorry y'all. But I really do appreciate you taking the time to actually send this and you know. Thank you. I just want to say thank you. Happy birthday. Wishing you loads of happiness on your special day. Lots of love from Las Vegas. La Nessa. What's up, girl? Whose most impressive weapon is this killer smile? Aw, that's some... That's some... Thank you. I'm glad you like my smile. Because uh, I was talking with somebody else, um, one of my friends, um, that... Uh, they were saying that in some like one of my videos in the comments like someone got pissed off for me eye smiling But you know what F y'all I'm gonna eye smile whenever I want because back in high school They used to make fun of my eye smile like crazy because I was the Asian guy or I didn't even look Asian But when I smiled I squint a bit like I go Even my mom it's like stop squinting Dre. I was like mom You're like Filipino you're Asian you squint too. What, what do you mean because she tries to go but you know, I'm gonna accept and go. <laughs> if, it, if it squints, it squints, whatever. That sounds weird. If it squints, it squints. What? Does my friend got you to say hi to me on camera at KCON? Hopefully, one day I can I can go and meet you. Aw, oh, okay. Someday. We'll do that. Uh, happy birthday, Dre. Happy birthday first. I hope your day is just as amazing as you and hope your birthday wishes come true. Date, date, girl. You know how they did? Because I get to spend and upload videos for y'all and you get to enjoy uh, whatever I upload somehow and that is already my birthday wishes anyways. <laughs> you and your videos make me so happy even when I'm going through a tough times which has been a lot recently so I want to thank you from the bottom of my heart. Damn it girl, you gotta get to my heart. Why y'all get into my heart? You are such an amazing person. You are such an amazing person. <laughs> like I'm arguing back. No, you are such an amazing person. And I hope you know that. I. I think I know that. I don't know. And all your craziness come to Vegas soon. I was there in Vegas. Hopefully I got to see you, Lanessa. Is this the same Lanessa? Oh, this is the same Lanessa that I just read. <laughs> it's just added more. Well, thank you, Lanessa. That was a sweet letter. I really do appreciate it. And thank you for the late happy birthday. It's my fault for opening it so late. So, bad. Oh, I hit the car. I shouldn't be hitting cards. Mwah. DJ. This is from DJ. All right, what's up, DJ? I just wanted to write you because right now I'm watching your birthday P.O. Box haul. I just wanted to say that you, the way you edit your videos and the faces you make have me rolling. Is that a good thing? That I, I, is my face off, what? It's really cool to watch you and how your videos have gotten so many more views. I relate to you in the sense that music in general has always helped me in my life. And to see that your channel is really awesome. Oh, and to see that on your channel is really awesome. Burke loves you. Spanish for Albuquerque. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, thank you. Thank you, Dev. That was really sweet. And um, it's crazy how JRE Camel, the channel as a whole, is actually growing. And it's all because of y'all and the new subscribers. Thank you so much. I mean, uh, to the new subscribers, this is me. Accept me. I'm glad they accept me. And thank you for subscribing. Hopefully, you stay. Yeah, <laughs> I'll be sure to give out them awesome content like I always do If you haven't already noticed, I mean if you do like my parodies, thank you for liking them. Go check out my new parody though, Zutter I did it with Kenny, Kenny boy, Kenny YG boy. This is all oh, the cues. I'm so cute. My name is Emily and I've only recently gotten into K-pop and watching 
your videos. I say recently, but it was more around January slash February. Uh, anyway, the first group I got into was New East. New East. New East. You've come such a long way. Your style is different. You seem more confident. Your videos are brighter. I mean, I just got used to the camera, to be honest. And uh, basically, it feels like I'm talking to just friends that I like to hang out with. So, you know, when you talk to someone that you're comfortable with, like y'all, I guess it shows. <laughs> Thank you, Emily Bell. I really do appreciate this. And I'll be sure to give Camel her a letter. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I'm still in, like, this Big Bang post-concert depression because I missed that concert. That was... That wasn't even a concert, that was an event. Yeah. And more vlogs of that concert coming soon, so look out for that. Dear Dre, first of all, hello! My name is Megan, and I've been a fan of your reaction videos since roughly February slash March of 2015. You have such a, uh, a wonderful, bright personality, and your positivity is uh, contagious. Well, I'm glad. I, 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 thank you. I, I, what? I've been a fan of K-pop about... 6th or 7th grade, so that's about 7 years. Wow. Uh, <laughs> Big Bang was the first group I ever heard, and for the longest time they were my favorite. However, BTS recently, <laughs> about 6 months ago, became my favorite. In turn, becoming a huge fan of Rapmon Namjoon. Anyways, I wanted to say I greatly appreciate your videos, and they never uh, fail to make me smile. Mm. I truly consider yourself an inspiration and a great positive energy. Keep doing you and never give up. P.S. My friend slash roommate slash basically... What? Alright, Megan. I like your signature, too. That's really do. That is... I, I love letters. I'm not gonna lie. I, I like reading letters. Thank you. And I'll definitely give this one to Cam now as well. Hands down. <laughs> I go by the name of a go go king Asia, aka young Asia, aka Asia. You know what? What? You can call me anything you want. I mean anything... You thought Dre was gonna get all the fan- Oh, this is the KML! <laughs> what you trying to say to KML? I'll give it to her later. Okay, I see you. Dear Dre, I'm Nayeli. I'm 24, and as a very recent, a super fan of yours. Oh, very recent, okay. Well, thank you, thank you. Why say it like that? Thank you. <laughs> thank you so much. Um, I came across your channel the day I came back from KCON at LA. Oh, wow. After seeing you over and over at KCON, unfortunately, I was not aware of this amazing YouTube K-pop community. Oh, well, girl, welcome to this YouTube K-pop community. I'm addicted to your vids. You are hilarious and bright up my days. Much love. Oh, and you sent a picture. Best friend, that's you. And the hubby. Oh, I see. He put a ring on that. Oh, you even put Big Bang. You, you already know that I love Big Bang. You already got my heart, girl. Let's see. Oh, is this a drawing? Ooh, girl. Oh, no, it's not. Never mind. <laughs> What's up, Dre? Long time viewer, first time writer. Hey! <laughs> I just saw one of your P.O. Box videos and it inspired me to write you. You get a lot of amazing and cute mail. This letter is nothing special. It look, it's special. That's for sure. It's very special. I'm subscribed to your main channel and your gaming channel now as well. Bring it. Hope you keep on going. Yes! I know I've been slacking off on my gaming channel right now. Hope you guys have been watching the Until Dawn series. I've completed it. Uh, but I'll continue another game. Uh, I think it's a Metal Gear Solid one, which I heard it was super dope. I know there's Star Wars coming up. Alright, look. I'm Mario. Oh my god. I just watched your Draw My Life video for the first time and it really... It was, and it was really important to me because I also feel that K-pop has saved my life multiple times, both the music and the friends I've made. I really connected with your story and I wanted to thank you for sharing it. Well, I mean, I don't know why I did the Draw My Life thing, but it was definitely a really tough time, as you can tell, during that time. And everything seems to be better, but yeah, K-pop definitely was a big part of that and the friends I made through K-pop. Oh, I'm getting a little emotional too. A lot of times I'm scared what people think of me because I'm such a big fan of K-pop. I think about how cool you are because you just love it and aren't embarrassed at all to be yourself. And like what you like, it gives me the hope and maybe someday I can get to that point as well. And achieve my final badass form. <laughs> I used to care what people think sometimes. I still do a little bit, but I just like K-pop. If you 
think it's weird, you think it's weird. Um, if you like it, you like it. Maybe you do like it. There's some things that... There's some dope stuff in K-pop or in Korean music in general. I mean... And hopefully, at least through my videos, somehow, or one of my videos can get through somebody like, Yo, maybe I should give K-pop a chance, or maybe I should just like, you know, listen to this group somehow. Um, yeah. <laughs> But I do have a, a particular taste in music, I guess. I, I, well, look, music has no borders, it has no wall, it has no language barrier. So, if you like the music you like, enjoy it. Don't be embarrassed. J.D. I don't know if I'm saying it right, but... Dear Dre, you are a great YouTuber over the two years I've been watching you. You are so funny by your faces, the words you say, but you are very handsome... I'm very handsome. Uh, my friends call me Jay or Jackie. Oh, okay, I see. What's up, Jay? What's up, Jackie? What's up, all three of y'all? Uh, <laughs> you and me are both artists. Love for anime k and K-pop. You make me laugh, smile, and also feel better about not grading it. Thank you so much to you guys. I have my own YouTube because of you. And Heather from Jellybean knows. Oh, yeah, shout out to Jellybean knows, for real. And you drew me. You made me really pretty. What the hell? You see this shit? Look at this. I'm pretty as hell. You make me look like a K-pop idol or anime character or something. You made me have big eyes. That's what happened. See, that's what it is. Can't stop staring at myself. What? Well, thank you, Jackie. I really do appreciate it. I love the drawing, too. We got a big one right here. Who is this from? Gao Zong. Gao Zong. This is J-R-E Camel. That's freaking dope. Thank you for that. Shout out to, uh, who, uh... It's Club Adventure created this symbol, and it's definitely the symbol of JRE Camel, so shout out to him. Okay, you have a Q&A for me. If you were a Pokemon, who would you be? Squirtle. When you were young, did you play Yu-Gi-Oh? Hell yeah! Act out Bruce Lee. <laughs> Can't believe I actually did that. Did you watch Disney movies? If so, name some movies. I watched... From Aladdin, Lion King, Little Mermaid, Mulan. Do I have Mulan with me right now? I definitely want. I love Disney. I love Disney movies. I love Disney World. I love Disneyland. I love Disney. Jackie Jet Li or Donnie Yen? You know what? If I had to choose to watch forever, Jackie Chan, because he's comedic and he's talented and he does, and his stunts are like all on his own, even though probably Donnie Yen or Jack, uh, Jet Li does the same. Uh, were you bad when you were young? I was a quiet kid. Uh, I still am pretty shy. Uh, if you guys meet me off camera, I could be very like quiet at times or like very shy sometimes. It, it's just it's just in my personality. Yeah, I mean, on camera, I, I like to talk to y'all, but if I am quiet and you see me like uh, um, like from afar somewhere, if you see me and I'm just like you know like by myself or anything, that's just me. So being a quiet kid, I was pretty mischievous as well. And yeah, I guess so. I was a little bit bad. When was your first kiss, if you had one? My first kiss was in kindergarten. <laughs> uh, now, favorite dance movies of all times. Dance movies? Uh, what's that one with Channing Tatum? Step It Up? No. Yeah? What is that? That's a good dance movie. High School Musical? Gao Zong, right? Gao Zong Tao? Tao? Well, thank you for this long letter. I did read it. And thank you for that little Q&A. <laughs> Yo, someone sent me... This G it got smushed again. Guys, you keep on smushing these hats. Stop sending smushed hats. It's like torture to me. Thank you so much for the G Dragon hat. I've definitely. Wait, let me see. Hell yeah. Hey yo, what's up, JRE Camel? That's what it says. I'm just a random K pop new from Canada that subscribed to your channel, lol. You guys are doing an awesome job on your channel. If I were to rate your channel, it would be the title of this album. Che you sent me an album? Tiana's A+. Plus. Oh, that's so cute. Not gonna lie. Though I do have this already, but it's nothing wrong having a second one. I could do a giveaway. I'll keep this one and do a giveaway. How about that? My channel's A+, plus to you? Well, according to YouTube statistics, I'm a B+. Plus. I don't even know if... Stoke. Stoke? What's up? <laughs> thank you for this album, and thank you for that awesome letter. You rated my channel A+. Plus? Well... Your your ratings matter compared to YouTube rating. You could call me B plus. Give me an A, A minus. Goddamn. Last but not least is this box right here. I don't know what y'all sending me boxes now. Jeez. All right, y'all. Let's go through this. Read letter first for gift receipt. 
Uh, oh, what gift? Will you give me receipts? I don't know if you remember me or not, uh, but I'm the girl who sent you the Mickey Mouse. Yes, the Mickey Mouse hat and the blue bucket hat. I have it over there. You'll need these when you go jogging. Thanks to me. Thanks to me later. There's more things that to unwrap. What? Like literally jog? I don't know. This might be a little bit too big for me, but definitely something to sleep in. Number two, to match your bucket hat that I sent you, and of course me too. <laughs> Justin Bieber, get out of here. Oh snap! Got me a Mickey Mouse shirt. If I ever go to Disney World, I'll be rocking this. Ish. I love Mickey Mouse. I love Disney in general. And I don't know. I love Disney, anime, and K-pop. I'm a weirdo, aren't I? What is this? Oh, shit. Pokemon doll. You got me Charizard, Squirtle, and Pikachu. Oh, that's kind of dope. It's like rusted, too. I definitely wear this. Thank you so much. Yeah. Oh, snap. Look at this. Oh, snap. Look, wait, hold up. Aeropasto? I, swag. I, I, wow, why did I even say swag, Dre? Wow. Dude, let me open Camel's. Camel got some funky socks. What? I actually kind of like these. Can I have them? I'm going to ask Camel. Nah, I'll give it to her. <laughs> I'm going to wear it. And then give it to her. Shh. Like I'm saying shh, but she's probably gonna see this video. What? This is awesome. Thank you, Linda. Thank you to everyone that has sent me a letter, a gift, or anything. I really do appreciate it. And yeah, I just want to say thank you to everybody for as giving me to the PO box. You guys don't have to send anything, but if you do, I am super grateful. And obviously, I'll do a PO box haul because I want to show my appreciation to you. So these videos might be like freaking 30 minutes long, but you know what? If you watch it, if you enjoy it, I don't know. Thank you so much. Anyways, till next time, I'm your boy JRE from JRE Camel. Love you all my sexy, beautiful people. And listen to K-pop, it feels good. Alright? <laughs> Bye. And thank you, thank you so much. I need... Thank you again.